Hi, today I'm gonna test run my newly designed tools. I call it the lock picking aid, which uh, assists me in uh, my lock picking because I'm not really a good lock picker. So I fabricate these tools to compensate my weakness in lock picking and stabilize my hand and. Uh, and also make my hand comfortable in lock picking. Uh, it is being attached uh, on a lock cylinder like this and being tightened by the screw. Right? And uh, this is a uh, interchangeable core a sergeant I'm gonna pick. It has no key in it. It is 16. So I will try and pick it uh, with the hair aid of this uh, lock picking aid of mine I had fabricated. Oh, uh -huh. it's okay. Uh, it's turning, so that means it's. Uh, working nicely and uh, alright so this is working this is good right so oh, oh by the way uh, okay it's already turned I uh, will try to and let's say we turn it uh, the wrong way, okay? It, it turns the wrong way. Alright, like this. Okay. Well, I'll try also to take advantage of uh, introducing another new tool, which i already been uh, posted in here in YouTube before. This is a uh, plug spinner, a very simple one. You know, this is the spring, and that is the I call that the torque, right? So I position it like this. I already put, uh, I position already the core to a jump overall position, and uh, cut this uh, spring mine, and then release, right? So it turns there, and so you can turn it again. How many times if you turn it? If you turn the core cylinder the wrong way, you can turn it many times as you like with this. And this is uh, reversible also. If you want to turn it the other way, right? You have to invert also the position of the torque, right? And also the spring, you have to invert it also, of course. And again, aim at it. Okay, that's how it is. Very simple one, right? So, thanks for watching.